Protests on the floor of the convention continued on Wednesday. They reached a peak when former CIA director Leon Panetta took the stage. While Panetta was criticizing Donald Trump's appeal to the Russians to hack Hillary Clinton's emails, many delegates started chanting, no more war. Donald Trump asks our troops to commit war crimes endorses torture, spurns our allies from Europe to Asia, suggests that countries have nuclear weapons, and he praises dictators from Saddam Hussein to Vladimir Putin. Today, Just after Leon Panetta stopped speaking, Democracy Now!'s Dina Guzder caught up with one of the delegates who took part in the protest. My name is Alexis Edelstein. I'm a delegate for California for the District 33, and I'm a, I'm a Bernie delegate. Who was speaking and what happened here at the DNC right now? The former director of the CIA, Leon Panetta, was speaking. The Oregon delegation started a chant, no more war. All the Bernie delegations, all 57 of them, states and territories, chanted no more war with them. Um, as soon as that kept going and going, the DNC shut off the lights to the Oregon delegation, almost as a way of showing that they want to silence them. Why did this action happen when Panetta was speaking in particular? The no more war action was, as you know, Leon Panetta, the CIA, the CIA, you know, it, uh, supporting foreign wars nonstop, continuously, and also initiating drone, drone wars. Hillary Clinton is a warmonger. Hillary Clinton wants to continue all the wars in the Middle East. Hillary Clinton is with Israel on the, on the Palestinian issue. Uh, we are for a free Palestine. Hillary Clinton wants to continue all acts of foreign insurgents, and Hillary Clinton, as the Secretary of State, was also responsible in supporting the uh, coup in Honduras. Uh, myself being from Argentina, I'm very sensitive to Latin and South American issues. I was born under a military dictatorship in Argentina that was uh, that was supported by Henry Kissinger, and Hillary Clinton is a supporter of Henry Kissinger. So that's why we're very anti-war, anti-Hillary uh, Clinton. Half of the half of the budget goes to the to the war budget, to the uh, to the defense budget, and that really sacrifices what else we can invest in: infrastructure, education, healthcare, all the things that we're, this country is lacking and that what Bernie Sanders is fighting for. That's Bernie Sanders delegate Alexis Edelstein. When